today's story is called Mary and Martha. So Mary and Martha and their brother Lazarus were really good friends with Jesus and they loved it when Jesus came to visit them in their home. One day Jesus was passing through their town called Bethany where they lived and he came into their home and they welcomed him in. They were very excited to see him. They always liked to hear the things that Jesus had to share. Mary hurried and sat near Jesus and spent time listening to him. Martha also wanted to spend time with Jesus, but she knew that Jesus must be very hungry after his travels. And so she set about cooking Jesus a meal. So Martha, who'd been looking after the house and sorting out all of the housework, continued to then make Jesus a meal. She had to get the fire ready so that she could cook all of the food. All the while that she was preparing the food to share with Jesus, Martha just sat there and kept on listening to everything that Jesus was sharing and telling her. Martha kept on hurrying back to the room to try and listen and to, to hear, but then she had to keep coming back quickly and check on the dinner, make sure that nothing was burning. Then she'd do it again and she'd hurry back into the room and still Mary was just sitting there listening to everything that Jesus was telling her. Soon, Martha became very frustrated. She knew she had the dinner to look after, but she equally wanted to hear the amazing things that Jesus had to share. And so Martha, who'd got so cross and angry, burst into the room and she said to Jesus, she said, why are you not telling Mary to come and help me? All of the feelings inside of Martha had bubbled up and she'd got cross. She was beginning to show some broken love. Now, although Mary was not helping to prepare the meal, Jesus was not cross with her. Jesus said to Martha, Martha, the things that I have to share with you while I'm here on earth are so important. I don't mind what food we eat. I don't want a big meal. I don't want fancy food. I just want you and I want you to spend time with me. In the same way that Mary stopped and she sat with me, I want you to sit with me because I know how much Mary loves me and I love her back and I love you too Martha and I want you to stop and not worry about the food that I eat. A simple piece of bread will be fine to fill my tummy. I want you to stop and spend time with me so that I can show you and teach you all about God's love and you can stop and learn and listen so that you will learn how to show love in God's world and not broken love. And so sometimes Jesus doesn't want us to be busy like Martha was. We can be too busy that we haven't got time to listen to the important messages that he has to share. So it's really important sometimes to stop so we can take time to listen to the things that are really important.